Uh, and so um, well, I was a philosophy major by background, and so uh, what? Uh, oh, that explains it. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. So the new data science um, mix of uh, that's right disciplines. I mean, yeah, like an intelligence analysis, uh, a lot of people are in the liberal arts area that also do good math, if you will, and so those two skill sets allow for creativity and then computation to come together. So for us, uh, what's underneath the covers, if you will? The fundamental difference is we look at a way a word is used in context, a symbol. So, like toothbrush. And you can figure out what toothbrush means without having an ontology of toothbrush, you know, being under hygiene or some other. Because, like, where do you really put toothbrush, right? Is it a stick? You know, is it, is it basically something that's under, you know, human hygiene? So where do you fit it? Well, it's known by how it's used. So it tends to be associated with toothpaste and teeth and generally mornings and hopefully evenings if you're, you know, very hygienic. So what the system does is it looks at patterns of the way a word is used in context to ground a word in terms of its surrounding material. And that's how a human baby does it too, right? I mean, they're exposed to, you know, here's the taxonomy that came down from Aristotle. And now we know what this means. They're exposed to invariant patterns. And what we do is we build that from the ground up, which allows us to handle data that's traditionally defied knowledge engineering. Um, and that those algorithms have been now ported to work on Hadoop and work at scale and on some of the hardest data sets you know in the world that are inside certain agencies. So it's is it a is it a sort of modern form of, of what I think of as classification, which is a brute force miserable exercise. It's sort of a an automated approach toward drawing inferences for this large corpus of data. Is that a fair description? Um, I think the way I would classify it uh, yeah, is no it's, it's yeah <laughs> it was a bad pun if it was one. Um, is as a clustering algorithm. So you look at the similarity of things and you build hierarchical similarity from the bottom up so that you can make things relate to other things with no a priori set of categories, yeah, right? Okay, right? And so we do have the capability to do entity extraction and sort of pattern recognition type approaches, classification approaches through training. Um, but we see that technology, while we would say we're comparable to the best in the world at that, and especially one that runs on Hadoop, um, we think that technology you know, is very useful at the high level, but it gets really hard at the details, right? Because a massive human investment is necessary to apply that at low granularity categories. So we try to do the, the, the hard low end stuff, the bottom of the, of the ontology wheel, from the bottom up algorithmically through clustering, and do the top down through classification. Yeah, so. okay. okay, so now. Uh